For CBS Sports, I'm Jorge Andres. Time now for news and notes from around the golf world. That's why we are joined by CBS Sports golf writer Kyle Porter. Kyle, Jordan Spieth releasing a new shoe. Tell us more about this. Yeah, Jordan Spieth, the Spieth One is what it's called. Uh, he's actually traveling to uh, Japan uh, to release the shoe. He's kind of going on this little uh, global tour. He'll be going to London uh, later on in the month. So. Uh, pretty interesting, you know. He, he's an Under Armour guy, and uh, kind of in the kind of in the same mold as as a Steph Curry starting his own line of shoes. And and Spieth is uh, he's been kind of Under Armour's golf guy from day one. So uh, good good for him for getting the shoe out there. I'm not sure that I love it. It's not it's not bad, but it, it's not my favorite sh golf shoe that I've ever seen. All right, elsewhere, Justin Thomas moving into the top ten of the official World Golf Rankings. Why the up move? Well, I, this was, I kind of wanted to toot my own horn on this. I actually predicted that he would go uh, from number 22, which is where he started the year, into the top 10. It only took two weeks for it to happen because he won uh, the first two tournaments of 2017. So he jumped up all the way to number eight. Him being in the top 10 actually lowered the average age of the world top 10 to below 30 years old for the first time ever. So really interesting there as, uh, as some of these young guys making moves into the top 10 in the world. All right, and finally, what should we watch for in the Abu Dhabi HSBC Championship? Yeah, the European Tour. One of, one of their big events, especially early on in the year, is the European Tour heads to the Middle East. Rory McIlroy obviously not playing because of a uh, stress fracture in one of his ribs. This is going to be a good event. Dustin Johnson will be there. Henrik Stenson will be there. Ricky Fowler is actually the defending champ. Uh, so it should be some really good golf. Uh, maybe a better field, uh, probably a better field on the European Tour than the PGA Tour this week. It'll be interesting to see who comes out on top on that one. Thank you, Kyle. Remember, for all things golf, make sure you keep it locked right here to CBS Sports.